everybody welcome back to my channel today we have the April 2020 Zen pop stationery box um, if you like cute stationery stickers please stick with me please subscribe because I have lots of this to share with you this is a monthly subscription box from Japan they Zen pop doesn't have just stationery they have all kinds of different Japanese goodies subscription boxes so I'm going to put a link below and you can go check out their website and see what you can find for yourself. But let's get this open and see what we got this month. Oh, here's a... They always put a little advertisement on top about made with Zen Pop. You can um, share what you made with their the things in the box and they might feature you or give you a prize for it. Here's a little cheat sheet. I'll look at that when I get lost. Let's see what we have. Oh, oh, right on top are these flower petal memos. Those are beautiful. I don't think they're sticky. Nope, they're actually loose in there. So that's neat. Very beautiful. Oh, it says the paper is delicate enough that if you hold a sheet in your hand, you can watch it curl slightly because of your body heat. Okay, so we're gonna... Uh -huh. Oh yeah, it's curling up. I don't know if you can see that. It's... Wow. That's neat. It's supposed to be very realistic. But I like those. That's very cool. And that when I put it down, it's going to flatten right back up again. Oh. Very neat. Okay, here's some masking stickers. There's 40 stickers in all. 10 sheets of 4 lovely masking stickers. Oh, that's adorable. Real tiny. Just peel them off one by one. Very pretty. It's like a little mini washi tapes. Here's a postcard with a very beautiful, looks like the memo sheet actually. It's a Sakura postcard. You can send a flowery message to someone you like. Oh, that's very pretty. It's actually um, sparkly. Oh yeah, you can definitely see that. Spring is joy and happiness. On the back has the bird and space for writing and addressing. Very nice. Oh, there's some cherry blossom stickers. Awesome. They're very pretty. I like those. Here's a stamp. It's an erasable stamp. And there's an eraser top on the back of the stamp. Alright, alright. We're going to play with that in a little bit, aren't we? Yes, we are. Oh. There's a little notebook. A little garden notebook. Here's the front. Very pretty. I love that pattern. And then the inside. It's got grid paper and there's 32 oh there's 16 pieces of paper so 32 double sides of paper to write in this is a good size to put in your purse to take me down notes very nice I like that here's a ball sign lame pen Wow, it's in a package. All right, we're going to open that up and play with it in a little bit. It has this touch of sparkle to express your joy. It's a water-based gel ink pen. So, yeah, we're definitely going to play with this in a minute. Here's the washi tape. Staying with the theme of the cherry blossoms. Just lovely. There's a little case. You, you can put your passport in it. It looks really like a wallet. You know, it's kind of clear. It has six pockets. You could fit your passport in here, your receipts. 
You'll get either a pink case with cherries or a yellow case with flowers. I got the yellow case with flowers, obviously. I like that because it matches the little notebook that was sent. So I'm getting a little purse set. And let's see, there's one more pen I'm missing in here. Shimmery pen. Brush pen. You know what? I think I got these mixed up. This is the brush pen. And this is the gel pen, and I'm very sorry for mixing the two up. I'm still going to play with them both. This is the sparkly. Once I saw the sparkles, I realized I got it wrong. But I didn't see this pen hiding in there. It was kind of under the tissue. I didn't notice until I read the pamphlet that I had one more pen in there. So there's something else to play with. So, let's do that now. Alright, I got me a moose paper. And I apologize for being sideways when I write. Because I am to the side. Alright, we're going to start with the gel pen, the sparkle gel pen. Sorry, it's blurry up here. Oh, I like this color. It's a nice bright pink color. I like that. Good letter writing color. Not too light, but very, very still very pretty. Okay, that's a click pen, that's cool. I'm gonna open up this one. Okay, is it nice? Has a nice tip to it. You can see the ink inside. So, let's see how it works. Oh yeah, oh my gosh, that's great. I thought it was gonna use a lot of ink because just the way it looks, I thought it was gonna be really ink leaky, but it's not. It's really controlled, very fine tip. It doesn't even seem like a brush. It really just seems like a, I guess it kind of seems like a brush, but it just seems like a very fine tip and I really like that. All right, let's see what the stamp is all about. Oh, it's a cute little flower. Oh, okay, so yeah. The end of it here shows it's a flower, obviously. Sometimes I don't always catch on to things. So here's the stamp. Oh, nice and clear stamp. I'm sorry, I did not focus that well. I'll do another one. I mean, it's... That's great. I'm going to decorate some envelopes this week to my pen pals. It's supposed to be erasable. And it, feel, it doesn't feel like an eraser right here. It really just feels like plastic. So, see how it goes. Oh, yeah. Oh, my goodness. I erased that right away. Now, I didn't, it wasn't completely dry because it was a fresh stamp. There it goes. It doesn't, it didn't erase all the way. If I sat here for a few more minutes and did it, but. Oop, I'm starting to just bend the paper, so. Well, that was neat. I think I, I mean, I don't see a reason why I would erase it anyways, but if I guess if you need to, it's nice that you can. All right, well, I appreciate you all stopping by today. Don't forget to subscribe because I always have these every month along with other stickers and other fun things to show you. And don't forget to give me a thumbs up and have a great day. Bye!